can't quite hear you. I'll just come down to the hall. Um, are you, or do you know Amber Wallace? No. Oh, she doesn't live with you then? I've been given specific instructions to deliver this bouquet to flat one on B floor. Oh, you call flat six. Oh, sorry. Uh, but flat one should be around here somewhere then, shouldn't it? Yeah, it, it should be. Do you think she'll be in? I, I don't know her, sorry. I've been given specific instructions to deliver these flowers to flat one on B floor. There's no one down on reception either. I really need someone to be in. Is it? Nice delivering flowers to people and for people. I mean, you must get a lot of happy people in your shop. Yeah, yeah. The the guy that ordered this delivery, he was he was really happy. He came in all excited. Well, either she's not in or she's still asleep. I used to be a steward at once. I know what it's like. Yeah, we love our sleep. Well, sorry. Wait, are you in today? Yeah. I know this is a long shot, but is there any chance at all I can leave this bouquet with you? Um. It's just, I'm a bit stuck now. No one's answering this door. There's no one down on reception and well, I've got other deliveries to make. Okay, yeah, I'll take them. I'll come back out later and I'll make sure she gets them. Thank you so much, you're a lifesaver. You really do me a massive favour, I really appreciate it. Not bad, just got one more example case to finish off. How's it going with you? Not well, honest. What? How much have you done? Have you even started it? Oh, you've been serious. It's due in in two days. Listen, I'll get it done in time, all right? just you know we all get graded on this. We had a fucking meeting. We went over everything. I better not get a shit grade because of you. Ugh.
Hey, Marshall. I thought you quit. Don't criticise me right now. I told you, I'll have it done in time, all right? It's not about having it done in time. It's about going through it before we submit it. Yeah, we can still do all that. Just don't worry about it, Marshall. Alright? Where are you going anyway? Uh, I'm just off the shisha to go meet the squad, so. See you Thank you. I didn't realise it was going to be one of those kind of nights. Neither did I. It's just been one of those days. Why? What's happened? It's that freaking ecosystems assignment. Marcus is in my group and he just, just doesn't give a shit. <laughs> Marcus, he's a funny guy. No, he's just a dick that cares about enjoying himself. Besides, you're supposed to be on my side about this. Right. Marcus, the dick with a contagious smile. <laughs> Why don't you just turn to get on with it? I have, but he just doesn't take me seriously. You know, I don't even think he realises that I have a first name. <laughs> Alright, Marshall. Alright, Marshall. <laughs> Did you spike my drink? <laughs> <laughs> We're not all the shit you are getting people into bed, you know. Getting people into bed? <laughs> <laughs> He's such a weak drinker, it's actually sickening. Stop! <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, can't breathe. <laughs> he could have oh. asked me out or bought me flowers or something. Oh, shit. What? Oh, no. What? Flowers. Who got you them? They're not for me. They're for the girl in the flat next door. I need to deliver them to her. <laughs> You're gonna do that in your state. Oh, the surprise will already be ruined because of the delay, so I should probably go take her the bouquet. Hey, that rhymed. <laughs> <laughs> So people do actually live here. Does Amber Wallace live here too? Yeah, she lives here, but she's not in. Great, great, take these. They're for Amber. Amber Wallace? The only one Amber lives here. Well, I only know one tax. And I'm gonna go carry on drinking with her tonight. <laughs> and who knows, maybe she'll find some flowers as well. <laughs> you already did. <laughs> 